Hey, this is Nettie with Rocket Pirate Sound. In this video, I'm gonna be putting together a flume style serum preset and give it away to you guys completely for free. The link to the preset will be in the description, so let's get right into it. All right, so let's uh, start by, of course, opening serum. We're gonna start with an init preset because, uh, you know, I wanna show you guys how to actually make this. Now, the thing with like flume is, I feel like his sound is more in like, arranging than like necessarily like a serum preset can like contain so what we're gonna do is we're gonna kind of create the basis for a flume preset i'm gonna i'm gonna show you guys how to use this preset to kind of sound more like flume so while i can't make a preset that will like immediately make you sound like flume will kind of like get you in the right direction so let's um what we're gonna be making is i don't know if i already said this we're gonna make a marimba so let's get a sine wave or actually more specifically, we could get like one of these like wave tables that kind of has like a sine. I don't, I don't actually know what the, which ones they are. We'll just go with a uh, sine wave for now. We'll get a sine wave. Turn that up a little bit so you can hear it. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna get a we're gonna turn on the noise oscillator. And we have these in the attacks miscellaneous section. You have these like glass lead sounds, and I'm sure there's like plenty of other cool ones, but the the glass lead sounds. Have, it's like these really cool like little transients that um, you can kind of slap at the beginning of your sounds and it, can, it, cr it creates this like really organic sound. So let's key track that. Just cycle through these a little bit. All right, we'll go with that. And then let's turn this down an octave. There we go. Listen to that. that. That sounds like a like, literally sounds like a marimba already. So <laughs> that's awesome. Let's add some just like decay and release. Yeah, I mean, I mean. <laughs> sorry. Um. <laughs> yeah, there you go. We have we literally have a marimba already. So this is this is fantastic. Let's um let's just add some like distortion maybe. Very cool. We have compression maybe, and then let's just add a reverb, and we'll kind of that's that's pretty much already it. Like it's such a simple effect, but yeah, there you go. So we literally have a, a marimba right now. We could we could um, maybe I don't know if there's any like parameters that we could kind of tweak. I guess we could like we could maybe add like. Like a distortion knob, maybe. We could we could also go a bit like a step further with like some hyper dimension, like make it kind of wide. So we could maybe like you know, take that, get a knob it's called wide, and then just like kind of put that about there. That sounds good. Okay, now let's um let's close this out. And now here's here's the fun part, right? So this is where you actually should have, like how are you gonna like arrange it? So we're get, we have a bit of like release going on um, with the the preset, which means that if we play like a chord, it's gonna have overlapping notes or a, like a little you'll sh uh, you'll see what I mean. So um let's let, let's get a little MIDI clip going, um and um let's lay out a chord. Let's, let's maybe put this in um, F, F sharp minor. And then let's just um here we could actually matter of fact so let's put this in f sharp minor like this let's go crazy let's let's do like just random notes yes make sure that's not clipping and then um take out some like unwanted notes like take out the d's d's nuts haha <laughs> sorry that was i don't know if i'm allowed to make that joke on here or not All right, there we go. That sounds really cool. All right, cool. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna uh, go to resampling mode and get this to audio. 
Um, by the way, let me just like pause if you want the MIDI for this. Uh, if you're like very, if you want this exact result, then you know, pause, maybe recreate this. <laughs> this is kind of a mess, but yeah, here you go. Just uh, yeah, yeah, you can you can go ahead and recreate that if you're really dedicated like that. And then um, let's uh, record that to audio. Great. So now we have this like little thing of of notes. Now what we can do is we can start chopping this up. So I mean, let's let's find some like cool moments, right? I like this little moment right here. We can we can just go like this. Maybe. Oh yeah. Yeah, this is really cool. And, and so like, you know, this is kind of how you get to sound with flume. I mean, you could like pitch this down as well, like, get some like kind of stretch artifacts going on. That's That sounds like flume. I mean, we could probably also slow this down a bit, maybe 20, 128. Yeah, there you go. I, this sounds awesome, and that's that's basically. It. I mean, that's that's kind of how you uh, how you start with flume stuff. So it's kind of a half serum tutorial, half like you know arrangement tutorial, but it's 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 kind of like part of the same process, I think. And I think I think it's important to you know recognize that. So yeah, I hope you guys were able to learn something. Again, the download to the serum preset is going to be in the description, and uh, yeah, uh, I'll see you guys in another video. Goodbye.